question from Norin Nation. I don't know if that's a male or female. Not sure if I care. They want to know how much of a beefcake am I? I think you're gonna have to meet me in person to find that out. <laughs> a lot. So some guy, Joey Foreskin, Joey Forsaken, Joey, no, Joey Four Strings, wants to know how it feels to be back as the one and only true beefcake, the mighty of Guar. It feels pretty good, you dumb son of a bitch. Stupid. Eric Sullivan writes in and wants to know there's a new Guar album in the works. Well, yes, there is, and it's done. It's in the can, not the shit can. It's in the can. It's going off the Metal Blade. That's right, we're back on Metal Blade for Lust in Space coming out the end of August. Uh, it's gonna shred your face! So Reverend Funk wants to know, are there gonna be new characters in the Guar Show this year with a new album, Lust in Space? And the answer is, of course, stupid. Of course there's gonna be new characters. Are there always new characters? There's always new characters. Yes, there will be new characters, and we'll kill them all. <laughs> Uncle John Boy wants to know if Guar ever gets alien pussy. <laughs> Of course, we get alien pussy. And he also wants to know, can Guar sing a Tom Jones song? Who do the hell do you think taught Tom Jones? How to sing his song? Of course we can. It's not unusual yeah. to be loved by alien pussy. -na -na -na. See, that's just a taste, that's all you get. You gotta pay for more. Razor Hoof! Razor Hoof wants to know how close you must be for my base to rip and burst and destroy your innards. Hmm, it's a good question. One that needs more investigation. I need more amplifiers! Come to the show and find out. Raise a hoof if you dare! Mad MF wants to know if there'll be costume changes. Costumes? What's he talking about? Yeah, maybe we'll wear like some slacks. John Harlow wants to know what my drug of choice is. All of them. Bring them to me, give them to me, and I will do them. Hunter P wants to know why I play Dean Razorbacks, Razorback V models. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. And think about your stupid fucking question. Why wouldn't I play Dean Razorbacks? They're the most metal weapon of choice that any metal bass player can play. And they sound great, they look good, and the girls dig them. Joe, that's a funny name. Joe wants to know why I'm not signed up on the Dean Forum. Because I'm too busy, man. I'm rocking. I'm touring, you know? Come on, you're sitting at home getting pimples and playing your video games and listening to your damn Dan Fogelberg. I'm out here working for you. No time for all that. And I didn't even know that it existed, so I guess maybe I'll look into it later. Why would I... Obson wants to know... What, who? I would clone? A human? Why would I clone a human? That's the dumbest thing I've ever heard of. There's too many of you anyway. I'd clone anything. I'd clone anybody. It's too much. Too many. I'd kill you. I'd kill the guy that was cloning the guys. Clown, clone, clown, cloner? Hell no. None of yous. J12289 or something, something. He wants to know if my armored suit hinders my performance. Now it enhances my performance. It makes me play better. It protects me from the elements. It makes me look good. Chicks dig it. The bass resonates off of my mighty chest plate. I only need two 410 cabinets. Two 410 cabinets because most of the sound resonates from my mighty chest plate. You can almost hear it. Hey, that's not an amplifier. This is my favorite Guar song to play. Hmm. That's a toughie. Perhaps Crush, Kill, Destroy, because it's my song and I sing it. Now the new record is a song called The Price of Peace, which will be my next favorite song to sing, because I sing it. Lemmy. Lemmy is my god. If I was to have a god, it'd be Lemmy. Lemmy plays guitar, like bass, like a rhythm guitar, and lead guitar, and bass all at the same time. And uh, I don't know, sometimes that's the way I play, to fill in the gaps. Some of that. William wants to know, what is my bass rig? I am currently using two PV Tour 700s along with two PV Tour 810 cabinets, and they're loud and horribly deadly. 
They're great. My guitar players keep telling me to turn down. <laughs> Success! Success!